Hello and welcome to a quick summary of the AI Fact Sheets 360 website. The goal of this site is to provide an overview of the Fact Sheets project, which is a research effort to foster trust in AI by increasing transparency and enabling governance. The introduction section provides a summary of the key ideas of a fact sheet. A fact sheet is a collection of relevant information called facts about the creation and deployment of an AI model or service. Some of the unique features of a fact sheet are, they are tailored to the particular model or service being documented. They are tailored to the needs of their target audience. They capture facts from the entire AI lifecycle and they are compiled with inputs from multiple roles in this life cycle. Given that fact sheets are tailored to a particular target audience or use, it is important to have a methodology for determining the appropriate set of facts, which we call a fact sheet template. The methodology section describes a seven step process to provide the details on how to create useful fact sheets. It also includes a link to a technical paper that provides more details. An important issue for enterprises is how to effectively govern the creation and deployment of AI models and services, known as the AI lifecycle. This section describes how fact sheets can form the building block to help automate AI governance in a matter that is consistent with the existing AI lifecycle. With a link to IBM's offerings in this space. And a simple example to illustrate the value that can be realized with this approach. The next section provides examples, fact sheets for specific models for two different use cases. The first use case represented by the first five examples is a model developer looking to obtain a model from a model catalog. We augment each example with tags that highlight some of the unique features of that example fact sheet. For example, if we look at the audio classifier fact sheet, we see that it contains lots of information about how the model was created. There's an overview, purpose, the intended domain for the model, information about the training data, about the model itself, its inputs, outputs, performance metrics, bias, robustness, domain shift, and so on. Given the early nature of, of fact sheet documentation, we've decided to augment the content of this fact sheet with additional insights from the fact sheet authors regarding individual facts to capture their thought process as they created the facts. The author's note, the author's note switch shows this additional information. Another unique feature of fact sheets is the concept of a template to control what content is pre present and the format the facts are shown. Here we can see the full description of facts, an abbreviated version, and one appropriate for a slide presentation. Looking at the object detector fact sheet, we see that a highlighted feature is the adversarial robustness analysis. This was done with the open source toolkit called Adversarial Robustness 360. Looking at the image caption generator fact sheet, we see a feature, a highlighted feature around bias. And by clicking on that link, you'll see a detailed analysis of gender bias for this model, in this case, using the open source toolkit, AI Fairness 360. The second example use case deals with AI governance, where various personas 
inside and outside of the AI lifecycle would like to benefit from the facts collected during model creation and deployment. The model in question here is a model evalu mortgage evaluator model based on a public data set from the U.S. government. The fact sheet demonstrates how various facts are collected during the various stages of the life cycle, such as the business user requesting it, data set being transformed, generating a model, validating the model by a data scientist, and also creating a challenge model, deploying the model information and information when it was actually uh, deployed. This fact sheet, as you can see, contains information on bias, explainability, and robustness using the three open source toolkits, AI Fairness 360, AI Explainability 360, and the Adversarial Robustness Toolkit 360. We also show another use of templates to tell the facts that a particular persona may find interesting, such as uh, the, business, the subset of facts a business owner might care about, or the data scientist person might care about, or the validator, or the ops engineer. Although these personas are all part of the AI lifecycle, others outside of it, such as a chief risk officer or a customer, can also have their own template. The final section of the website are, is, our, is resources, where we have our papers, uh, related work, including uh, old papers in the field, uh, information about transparent documentation guidelines, policy, sites, and product offerings. We have a section on events, uh, a section on videos, which features over 24 hours of videos are on topics like trusted AI, fairness, explainability, adversarial robustness, transparency, science for social good, and the intersection of HCI with AI. We have a Slack community, which provides an opportunity for dynamic discussions about fact sheets, uh, a glossary of terms that we use, and frequently asked questions. Finally, on the top right here, we have direct links to the other toolkits that I mentioned earlier. The Fairness 360 Toolkit, Explainability 360 Toolkit, Adversary Robustness, and, and this website. We hope you enjoyed this quick overview and look forward to meeting you on Slack.